What up guys? This is going to be a video on the Truxedo Sentry tunnel cover. This is for the Ram 1500s. Mine is a 21 and mine does have the split tailgate. I do have a little issue with it, but I'll show you that in a little bit. But here's the fitment you can see. It's super low profile, which is pretty cool, honestly. And you can see it rained earlier. So we'll see how much water got through. And we'll go over a couple other things. The main thing I can show you the, the couple issues I'm having right now with the fitment. The main, main one is right over here. As you can see, it's like, there is a big hole here. I was gonna go to like Home Depot and try like filling it with black silicone or something like that. I'll have to try fixing that out. It, it sucks that you couldn't really, they couldn't have a good fitment from the beginning, but what can you do? I mean, other than that, it worked perfectly fine. Like it fits fine. And in this other corner, there is a little bit of a gap too. But it's not bad, we'll see. I'll show you when I open up the tailgate right now. You can see if I were to just do it normally, it works fine. One thing I want to mention is that you do have to pull the string, flip it up and then close it. And then if you want to use the tailgate, this is where I'm having a, a really bad issue. You can see the one little the gasket's already getting torn. Just open this. And you can see here, it's already ripping. I didn't even have it on for that long, which is kind of crazy. And then here's this one. This one's fine for now. Because I, I don't really use this one too much, but we'll see. And then here is the moment of truth of how much water came in. You know, I think I got lucky where it wasn't that bad of rain. Yeah, thankfully it wasn't that bad of rain, but you can see as your water got in. Honestly, the best thing you can do with this is probably just keep all your, your drainings like clean that's about the only thing i can say other than that i mean it's pretty like this the construction of it's like they're decent the only ever spots i have where it's leaking are in the front and i can show you what's different with the with having the split tailgate you see it's just how it mounts which i personally don't like you can see it's just a washer and a bolt that go into your the brackets it's right here i don't really like it because there's way too much like room going back and forth and then if you were to put it too much forward like you won't be able to get the boat on with a socket and if it's too far back we have the same issue so I, how i did it i just put it where i can get a socket on it and then i guess that's where it leaves gaps in but other than that it's not bad and one other thing i wanted to show you is when it is rolled up and I use my the strings to tie it down I just use these holes that are in the bed already and it didn't, didn't really come with anything else it didn't give me an option just as to like mount it up and that's it I can, I can show you real quick yeah I'm gonna strap this side up I'm gonna pause strap it up and I'll show you in a minute all right, that's how it looks. And you can see, I just hooked onto the lip. If you really, really want to secure it, you can hook it into the little holes that are there. I don't know if you can see it. <laughs> right, I guess I'm supposed to do the other side as well, but what can you do? One thing I do want to show is that uh, how it looks when it is rolled up. Let me just get this out of here. This is one of the reasons why I chose this kind of this style of roll up for the tunnel cover instead. 
this is how it looks from the back. You can see there's still plenty of room to look out. And you have plenty of bed access too. I was gonna get a a trifold, but you can see it has it takes up almost none of your bed space, which I freaking love. And then if we go inside, you can see. Yeah, there's plenty of room to look out of there. It's just like halfway up from the headrests. And if you were to have a trifold instead, you would have no access at all to the rear view. See, it was raining a little bit. So I think after I like fix that hole up with like some silicone or something, I'm sure it'll have no leakages at all. But that's the only issue that I'm having is just in the front two corners. And then I know, I know this is going to give me problems in the future. But other than that, if you have any questions or if you want to see anything, as always, just leave a comment. I'll do my best to help you guys out and show you any views that you want to see. And how, if, if you do want to use the split tailgate feature, you do have to shut them the regular day, then open the entire thing, and then close it because you see kind of pinches it same thing with this side so every time I use this feature yeah you can see it's that's destroyed okay anyway so you see it seals up right here but I, I, I'm not too sure I, I'm sure I'll figure something out like I'll put another seal that's definitely one thing to consider so this is gonna start leaking like crazy from here too so we'll see. I mean, I, I've taken it through car washes a couple times and I've only ever had leakage in the corners. So, I mean, it's good. I mean, so hopefully you, you got an idea of how this looks. If you have any questions or if you want to see anything else, again, leave a comment. I'll be more than happy to help you out. I don't know if I talked about it, but I did get these little bed caps got this from Amazon I mean completes the look it's funny that you buy the top trim model but you don't get bed caps in here that's fine though and again this is the this is a 2021 with the split tailgate and it works fine I personally like this one because of the the look I like it it has like a leather look to it which goes with the whole like limited trim feel I'll do a quick walk around I'm sure you got the idea I don't want to drag this off for too long I personally really like it I like it though but I wish the fitment could be better and I don't know if I did mention it but this was this this almost cost me a grand and when you're paying that much for this shit <laughs> you would you would expect it to be perfect but again I'm sure I could like fill this in with black silicone so it doesn't stick out too much. And then the other side, I'll have to do something else with it. Just just to keep it just to keep it in mind what might happen to you. Yeah, as you can see that, that gap is huge. I don't know. I've tried sticking it under here, but I'll figure something out with that. Alright guys. Thank you for watching. I always appreciate it.